Hi guys, it's Mangamix here. Hope you're doing well. I'm doing fine, thank you. I wanted to update you guys on a bunch of stuff. I'm not feeling too well today, so this is the only video you're going to get, but March, full steam ahead, two videos every day. Going to work really hard and get you some amazing content out. Uh, anyway, first of all, important things. Uh, the game in the background is Bit Trip Runner 2 which has a really silly extra title to it that as well. It's really good fun, really addictive, and I really recommend it. And I'm not that great at it, but I like it a lot so far. Uh, anyway, things I wanted to update you on. What to expect, first of all, in March. Um, and if you're one of my title card people, or if you haven't been one of my title card people, but you want to, if you want to do a title card for one of these games, and I need it, drop me a PM and I will do my best to respond to you. I always get so many, it's hard to deal with everyone, but I'll get there in the end. <laughs> um, so games that I want to look at next month, um, I want to look at the One Night RPG Maker series. I think that sounds like a good cool thing to work on if people like it. It's not overdone either, so something a bit different. Um, so that's that. Um, that's the first main title I really want to look at. A bunch of you have been requesting this out, but it's already overdone now, and I didn't really like Mad Father that much, so uh, I'm not sure I want to do something by the same creator. Um, but yeah, um, there's also a bunch of other titles I have my radar on that I am now currently going to <laughs> look up, because I can't actually remember the fucking names of the games, but um, we'll get there in the end. First of all, Send of the Arrival the full version is out at the end of the month, so I'll definitely be doing a full playthrough of that, as I'm sure will nearly everybody ever. But you know, it's uh, an enjoyable series to watch, and I quite liked the demo, the the beta, sorry, of um, of Sunday the Arrival. So I'm looking forward to seeing what else lies within the series. Um, other stuff I'm going to do. I've got my eye on a few other indie games from Desura that I would like to do you a few videos on, which may or may not include Pathological, um, may include some videos of Project Zomboid. There is a new sort of anatype game called Eleusis, I think it's called, that I may look at. Um, and uh, there's one called Sarcoex is Haunted again, which is like another new uh, indie horror thing, which uh, could be good, could be bad. I don't know, we'll have a look um, and experience those together, you know? Um, if you do want me to do them, if you think they're good things to check out, I'm to leave a comment below and give me some advice and that sort of thing. Uh, other stuff that I'll be doing, I'll be continuing with the Minecraft series because you guys seem to enjoy that very much, at least so far, which is great because, uh, well, I, um, I really enjoyed making it with Isaac and we're hoping to do various maps with various other people as well and make the horror of Minecraft like an ongoing series, as it were, which um, hopefully you guys will enjoy. Um, bit of Minecraft RP, as it were. Um, I'm going to finish System Shock 2. Most of you seem to hate it. Most of you, I saw lots of comments dismissing it instantly because it's like got bad graphics and stuff and it's not uh, new, but whatever. I think it's one of the greatest titles of all time and one of the best stories of all time in a game as well. So I will be finishing it because this is something I'm going to play for myself because I really like it. And there are some of you watching it even though it's not many. So um, thank you very much. I will probably not put them out as much as I have been but there'll be at least at least three a week I'd say of that. So uh, expect some more System Shock 2. There's some more un un unedited stuff I've done with Red of Magicka as well that needs to go up still and I'll be doing the fourth part of that um, very soon. I was going to do it today, but I feel like shit, so um, I decided to put it off. Um, what else do I need to do? Um, yeah, those are the main things I want to focus on. Um, I'm hoping to do like some more, obviously, one-shot games and things like that, the usual stuff that you tend to see on the channel. Um, if you have any recommendations of ones I haven't done, I know everyone's going to go, Play Eyes, Michelle! Play Eyes! Because everyone will say that, because everyone's been saying that to me for the last 24 hours repeatedly. Um, and, uh, yeah, so that sort of thing. If there are any mods you know about, especially ones for, like, Amnesia or Thief or Half-Life 2 or whatever, or Half-Life, uh, leave a comment below with those as well. I'm trying to like make March 
an amazing month of horror and stuff because from April I'm going to be going back to school and um, while I still be making videos and I'm not quitting YouTube and all that kind of stuff I will be putting less time into the channel um, I will try and make sure you still get one or two videos a day on most days but when I have other commitments uh, and things like that there might be more days where you only get one video that kind of thing I'm, I'm going to try and work a schedule though so I can keep making content because I really enjoy doing it so yeah um, cancelled series a bunch of you are really going to be pissed off with me um, but this is something I keep doing I keep starting series and then something goes wrong and I never finish them it makes me want to record them all in one go but that's usually like an impossibility for my attention span um, Fibrillation. I can't get it to finish. Every time I get to the end, it crashes so you never see the end and I don't know why it's crashing and it's infinitely frustrating because I've played through it now three times and it's kind of losing its charm. Um, so you won't see the end of Fibrillation. Thief. Uh, the Thief mod I was doing, uh, What Lies Below. I can't figure out what the fuck to do at the end. Um, there's some puzzle. It's way over my head. I've watched guides. I don't even know how to get certain parts of it prior to this bit of the the puzzle has like various like parts to it it seems and I can't even figure out the first part and I'm watching videos like it just seems to happen and I don't know what's going on so what lies below I was I nearly finished it and it's frustrating that I can't finish it but I just can't do it and um, it's quite frustrating um, but what you gonna do uh, what else haven't I decided? I'm going to finish, like I say, finish System Shock 2. I know a lot of you are worried I'm going to cancel it, but I will do it just to say, like, maybe not as often as I was going to. And that's about it, really. That's the the key things, really, I wanted to talk about um, for, for March. Um, the new stuff starting tomorrow, I'm going to start doing a, a little playthrough of Home that will only be three parts, but it's a nice little story, and those who haven't experienced it, or if you have experienced it, see what, you know, what I can make of it, because it's very much uh, an adventure that changes depending on what you do and all that kind of shiz, so yeah. Uh, so yeah, just expect a bunch of stuff. There's loads of new stuff being greenlit that's horror related as well, so I'll look at all of those. It's an exciting month, and I hope you guys will join me. So, uh, Bye for fucking now, and I'll see you guys really fucking soon. Bye for fucking now.